live from NBC4. This is the Channel 4 News at 5.30. My arms cut off with my arms over the snow burning like this, and then this part of my shirt caught on fire. That is a nine-year-old boy who was severely burned because an apartment's heater didn't work. He tried to warm his hands on a gas stove. And now a jury is sending a strong message to landlords. Good evening once again, everybody. I'm Paul Moyer. And I'm Colleen Williams. And so we begin at 5.30 tonight with the case of that young boy who suffered painful burns because he simply wanted to keep warm. Now a jury has ordered the owners of a Hollywood apartment building to pay millions to the victim. Channel 4's Denise Valdez is live in Hollywood with the latest. Denise? Well, Colleen, at the time, that little boy was six years old and he was burned inside this apartment building, as you said, trying to stay warm. Now, by winning this case, the owner of this building is going to have to pay millions of dollars. But it also sends a very strong message to landlords as well as to tenants that they do have rights. Very painful. Quantes Castillo will never forget the night he was badly burned. His family was living in this East Hollywood apartment. It was cold, the apartment heater did not work, so they were using the stove. I, I was cold, so I put my arms over the stove burners like this, and then this part of my shirt caught on fire. And then I was screaming, then my mom came out there and she tried to put me out. That was nearly three years ago. This week, a jury awarded Quantes nearly $6 million in damages. The family's attorney proved the apartment owner failed to provide heat, a necessity required by city law. Well, the law requires that every unit that is being rented out in the city of Los Angeles must have a working heater. This landlord did not perform any inspections or any maintenance of the heat heating system in this apartment. The family stopped living here immediately. Most people who do live here are low-income working families who can't afford to live anywhere else. Monica Venegas' heater was repaired one year after the accident, and she still wants the owner to do something about the rats. I would like to move out, but I cannot afford another price. You know, it's, it's kind of, in these days, the apartments are very expensive, and the... I mean, we don't, we don't get too much money. Quantes will always wear the scars of what happened to him that night. But the settlement money will allow him and his mom and little brother to live a better life. We'll be able to move to a new environment and get a new house. Now, I did speak with the owner of this apartment building who tells us he does not plan to appeal the jury's decision, but he does plan to check all of the 28 heaters inside of this apartment complex before we get into the serious winter months. I've got a phone number I'd like to show you. If you are a tenant who lives in L.A. City and you are having problems, you're urged to call the Department of Housing. There's the phone number. It's 866 557-7368. That is a hotline where you can get help if you're having problems with your landlord. One final thing. The fire department urges people not to use their stove during the winter months to stay warm. It's simply too dangerous. Reporting live tonight in Hollywood, Denise Valdez, Channel 4 News.